Hey YouTube, what is up? So as you can see, I have this cute little mustache on my face. Um, yeah, so I made this earlier at work today. It's like falling apart. Those of you who saw me on Facebook, you guys got to see the little um the picture of me in it and it was super funny. Thanks for all the awesome comments, guys. You guys are great. You just make my day. You're so funny. But anyways, I have two haul videos. Oh, also, and those of you who don't follow me on Facebook, I got this cool Fillmore Cars tattoo. It's not real. It's temporarily. I'm not into tattoos personally. But um, I did it with the kids. They shared with me because I brought them these, all these cool tattoos. And they shared with me. And this... I hope no one gets offended if you have tattoos. That's awesome. That's great. They're just not for me. I could never have a tattoo, especially where you can see it, because it won't match my clothes. Like, that's killing me. It's just, but it's so fun to have this on. I think everyone should have a temporary tattoo if they want before they get it permanently. So it just pretty much made me be like, yeah, I'm, tattoos are just not for me. So, anyways, but this is a haul video. I'm going to do two videos today. One scrapbooking related and one Halloween. Um, those of you who follow me on Facebook, again, you guys know that I'm throwing a Halloween party. And I was asking you guys for ideas and advice. Um, I'm in my first place and I'll be throwing a party. I'm stoked. I'm so excited. So I found tons of awesome stuff today on the way home from work. Um, all at the dollar store. So most of you, I hope, have dollar stores. If you're into Halloween, you can stop in. Because um, the guy said once their stuff is gone, it's gone. Like they don't really get it back in. So I spent $24.61 at the dollar store. And um, for this Halloween party, I set a budget of between $60, no more than $75 spent on this party. And I want to go all out. So of course I'm going to be making tons and tons of awesome stuff. I'm going to be doing mustache straws and all kinds of cute stuff. So stopping in the dollar store really helped me uh I've spent half of my budget already, and I've already basically got everything I need. Now I just need to get, like, cookie mix and stuff like that. So I might even be under budget, but I doubt it because I'll probably just buy until I reach my max point. So let's go ahead and start with the Dollar Tree haul. So this is one of my favorite things I got. Um, it's a black plastic plate, and it's got skeletons. Can you guys see those? And I thought this would be perfect for my cookies. They had an orange one with pumpkins, but this was way cooler. And um, I'm going to be doing peanut butter cookies with little candy, a little candy corn on top. So the orange is going to pop better on the black. So I thought that was super cool. One dollar. I mean, it's pretty big. So my head's pretty big, so you guys can see it. It's huge. Okay. Next um, is this little, what do you call it? It's like a little foam styrofoam stand. And, um, of course, it's Halloween theme. It just says rest in peace. It's got these cool bones. And I thought that that was cool. Um, I don't know where I'm going to put it yet. But, I mean, for $1, and he said once the stuff is gone, it's gone. Um, this is one of my favorite things that I picked up, so I got two. It's Skeleton Garland. And I was thinking of, I have like a little bar, and um, I'm totally going to decorate it and probably have these guys hanging off of them. So I got two packs of those. And I'll be sure um, when I have my party, I'll take tons of pictures um, before the party. And probably not during, because it is going to be a college party. So I don't know what's going to happen. To be honest, I'm going to be good, but I don't know about my guests. I don't know what's going to happen. But I'll be sure to take pictures so you guys can see it all decorated and stuff. These are cool. These are just little, um, of course I could have made these on my Cricut. Um, they're just little spider uh, silhouettes. But they were dollar, and I don't know if I have a spider um, cartridge. So I went ahead and got it. Not to mention the time that it's going to save me. So they're pretty decent size too. And there is 15 in here, which is awesome. So as you can see, um, I can hang them up or whatever. This is cool. This is creepy cloth, which is really like cheesecloth. And they had it in gray and black. And I went ahead and got two in black. Um, I don't know how much is on here. It doesn't say. But it feels like a good amount. And I'm probably going to hang it. Um, I have a sliding glass door reading leading out to our porch, and I'll probably hang it from the drapery rod. I'm not sure, though. But I went ahead and got two of those. Um, I thought this was super cool, and only $1. So, 
Um, I'm probably going to put this on the outside of our door. I'm not sure because I got, I got this thing, a Halloween door cover. thought that was cool. So this might go on the inside of our door, maybe on the outside. I'm not sure because I kind of want this to be on the outside of the door. Like this is really, really cool. And it was only $1 and it even has like a metal ball down here. Like this thing is pretty good good quality for her dollar. So I thought that was super cool. So of course I grabbed that. As you guys saw, I got this door thing. I thought that was cool. Um, I want this party theme to be like a mix of my personality, Martha Stewart Halloween, and a little bit of scary. Like, um, you know, like that kind of scary. Definitely it's not a kid's party. It's definitely an adult party. So... Um, then I got two packs of spider web, and it comes with the spiders, because I was at Michael's tonight, and these were $2.99. Yes, they will go on sale for 50% off, probably, but there was not nearly as much, and I don't think it had spiders in it. So I got two of those. Um, I might go back and get another pack, but you can make that stuff last pretty good. Next is a super cool tablecloth. As you guys can see, and it's, it's skeletons, and it's got... Uh, let me see. Sorry, I can't see on camera. You see, it's got um, scalloped edges where the skeletons are. So, I thought that was cool for the food table. Um, then I picked up this orange bowl. Again, it's huge. Um, I want to get the tortilla chips when they come out for Halloween. They're going to be, uh, they're black and orange. So, I thought these would be cool to put in those. And then, you know, I'll have dip for it and stuff. So, I got those. Um, something else I got, I'm not sure if I'm happy I got these, but they were only, obviously, their dollar piece, and you get 14 cups in each one, because I was gonna just get, like, plain colored stuff from Walmart, I wanted to do lime green cups and then black and orange plates and purple, maybe, but I picked these up, um, so, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use those yet, I don't know, because I'm kind of picky about, like, since this is my first party. Next, um, I got some crepe paper in black and orange. That's a good deal. It's a two pack instead of, um, you get one of these at Walmart for a dollar. But that's cool. Black and orange. Because I'm only going to need a little bit. Um, next, I got this super cool bat. One dollar. So, and he's pretty big. Again, here's my head. So, I just think that is so cool. And I love the red eyes. I just couldn't, like, I don't really shop at Dollar Store, not because I'm too good for it. I just, I normally go to Walmart. I don't know why I don't go to the Dollar Store, but I don't. So I didn't even think to really go to the Dollar Store. But after going to Marshall's and Michael's, I was like, this Halloween decorations are so expensive. I'm not going to be able to get anything in my budget. So I was like, let me at least go to the Dollar Store. I'll just check it out. It's not going to hurt. And I'm so glad I did because I found all this awesome stuff. Next. A cupcake stand for one dollar and they had all different um cupcake stands and they have different themes of each item i'm showing you um but this is my favorite one that they had and it's actually like a little frankenstein house at the top but i definitely need a cupcake stand because i'm making cupcakes and um i was gonna just buy the wilton one at walmart it's like five or six dollars and decorate it myself but this is already done and not to mention this is one dollar which gives me extra money to spend on other stuff next i thought this was cool this is um glass and again one dollar and it's rp and this is just gonna like sit with the food or something and the rp is sparkly I don't know if you can see that, but I thought that was cool. And they had a bunch of different ones of these, but that was my favorite, so I picked up that one. Um, next, there's this LED strobe light, and I need to add batteries. It takes two AAA batteries, um, but it's a strobe light. I don't know if, I don't think I'm going to put in a pumpkin. I think I'm just going to keep it as a strobe light, like near the food or something. I'm not even going to, you know. Okay, so there's 50 rings in here, orange and black. Um, I want to put some, like, scattered on the table, on the cupcakes, um, a mini mouse, so I can't wear one of these, but, you know, maybe my party guests will wear them, I don't know, because there's so many in there. Okay, next, again, one dollar, this is pretty big, and it's got a hanger here, so it is pretty big, and it says beware, and it's got this creepy face. But, um, I don't want people coming into my bedroom, so I might put this on my bedroom door, 
and I need to add like a do not enter or something, but I don't want people coming in my room. Weird. Um, okay, so that's everything from the dollar store, but I have two more Halloween items. I stopped at Marshall's on the way home, um, because I remember seeing a ton of Halloween stuff there before I was going to throw a Halloween party. Now that I'm throwing one, um, I went back. And they also had these at the dollar store. Um, but these are the Martha Stewart ones, and I got these for $1.99, and these are better quality, and they might be cuter. But I think you get 15 in the dollar store one. This has 12, but, you know, I really don't care. Um, so I got those to... I don't have stairs in my apartment, but I definitely know I can use them. Then I was so excited about these. They go on the bottles, and I think there's five or six. There's six in here for $1.99, and they had two different themes, but I like this theme the best, the orange and green ones. Um, so if I put these on full bottles, of course they'll get drunk. They'll, people will just drink them, and that's going to make my budget go way up. So I'm just going to ask like somebody that drinks. I don't really drink, but maybe like my parents don't really drink either, but um, I need to ask one of my friends that drinks beer or wine to save me a couple of the empty bottles. And then um, I'm probably going to like paint it, throw some water and black acrylic paint inside the bottle because it will be empty and it might be clear. Shake it up and make it dark like that. And then I'll add these labels on it into just empty bottles and like put them around the bar at the food or whatever. So anyways, I got the, all that Halloween stuff for 24 28 bucks. So that's pretty much half my budget. And then the other day I spent like five or six dollars on Halloween stuff. So pretty much the rest of the stuff I'm going to um, use for like the cookies and the cupcakes that I'm going to be making and sprinkles. And um, I'm going to be making like a Halloween banner. Um, I need to buy pumpkins because I got a really cool thing. So that's probably what the budget's going to go to. Most the rest of it is the food. Um, and then pumpkins that I'm going to be doing something really cool with. I'm excited. So anyways, thank you guys. Also, my parents, they don't do Halloween. Um, so they're letting me borrow all their decorations. So I'm stoked. So thank you guys for watching. Please um, like this video if you liked all the stuff I got. If you have any Halloween ideals, please um, let me know on Facebook or here or whatever. Send me a link to the idea or just type it, whatever. Thanks, guys. Talk to you later. Peace out.